So as we track all the reactions coming in from an elated ISRO, let's get you a reaction of our Prime Minister Narendra Modi, who is tweeting from Paris, very clearly tracking what's happening back in India, knowing full well the might of this moment. He's tweeted, and I quote, Chandrayaan 3 scripts a new chapter in India's space odyssey. It soars high, elevating the dreams and ambitions of every Indian. This momentous achievement is a testament to our scientists' relentless dedication. I salute this spirit and ingenuity. So this is the Prime Minister's message to ISRO on behalf of the entire nation. All of us all smiled as ISRO has done it. Another successful launch, another feather in their cap. And that's why, as you see there, the ISRO's chief is all smiles as he congratulated his team for all the hard work that they put in for the last four years to ensure that this moment becomes a reality, to make every single one of us Indians so very proud of the Indian Space Research Organization. This was a small memento that he handed over, a model of the Chandrayaan-3 mission that he gave to Union Minister Jitendra Singh. But the message from all of them there at the Satish Dhawan Space Center is that this is a moment that they've been hoping and praying for, but that they promise they will continue to work hard on this mission. This is the first step, a much needed step, yes, but the first step towards ensuring that the Chandrayaan mission is a success. The next 40 days, ISRO will continue to work hard. There's no time to rest, no time to rejoice and enjoy the fruits of all of their hard work. They will continue to grind and work it out because in the next few weeks, they will be tracking the movement of Chandrayaan-3 and will also focus very clearly on ensuring a soft landing in 40 days from now, roughly August 23rd, 24th is in fact the date that's been given. But a lovely message really that's come in from the ISRO chief who says that our dear LVM-3 has already put Chandrayaan-3 craft into uh, the orbit around the Earth. So this is the message from them. They knew that their Bahubali, as LVM-3 is referred to, would do the job of taking off from Sri Harikota and throwing Chandrayaan-3 into the orbit.